How's it going, everyone? Maryland here. That's right. It's time for some more Animal Crossing New Leaf Adventures in Cheville. So, let's see how things are going over in the lovely town of Cheville this afternoon. Okay, let's see. Yeah, we'll get this started. Oh man, it's just been one of those days, alright? It seems like things have just been breaking, not working right, and... Oh man. Um... Really a problem. So, before the stream started, my capture card was just not working for some reason. And... I didn't actually blame the capture card. Like, again, I... I leave my computer on overnight because I have to upload gigabytes of data all the time. And yeah, it's just kind of one of those things. So, yeah, anyway, uh, yeah, I don't really know what your deal is, Tutu. Kind of boring. Yeah, so that was like a pain that I had to reboot my computer. I'm working on a two computer recording setup actually, and I actually like how it's turning out, but, it's kind of one of those things that I, I don't know, I need to get figured out. And I thought I had it figured out, but for some reason it just was not working. Like, I wasn't getting the video capture, I wasn't getting the audio capture. Like, I don't know, things are just all messed up. It's just like, ugh, oh, come on. And then, like, my computer was freezing because I tried to open up this project in uh, Premiere. Like, import this video, and it just did not work either, so... It, I don't know. It was a pain. Gosh darn it, it was just a darn pain. But, yeah. Anyway, hopefully things go better. So I did at least get the, uh, whatchamacallit? The, uh, rainbow stag for bones. So I got a tent wall for that. Whoops. <laughs> That's really great. Thanks, buddy. Alright, so I was actually doing a little bit of research. First of all, uh, someone in the comments of YouTube actually said you can get hybrid red roses with, I think it was orange and white, and I don't believe that, to be honest. I did look at one website, uh, Thonky, and they said it, but I've not actually seen that personally, and I kind of question that. However, that did give me the idea to start looking around at different options here. So, actually, what I found out was interesting. So, basically, flowers can kind of remember their parents, I think, or something like that. It looks like there's a lot more to it than it sounds. So, maybe that was what it had to do, or had to do with it, or something. I don't know. But another thing that I kind of had figured out from all this is, actually... I could probably take my blue roses and try to get a hybrid, or not even a hybrid, just another blue rose with that, rather than wait for these to grow. So what I'm going to do, I have one set of blue roses, but I'm thinking if I breed them together with anything, it doesn't matter what, there will be a chance that I'll get more blue roses. Just because that's kind of one of those things that I guess it remembers. So, I don't know. We'll have to see. I'll try it out. Again, right now I just have my blue roses over here for safekeeping. But, I think it'll be alright. Alright, so. This might work. It might not. I wouldn't mind getting some more black roses. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put these blue roses over by the black roses. Just on the off chance, I can get a black rose. Or a blue rose, better yet. Uh, but, you know, if I'm going to get a failure, it might as well be of something that I could use. And black roses look pretty nice. So, uh, I think all I need to do is set it up... Well, let's put it right here, I guess. Oh, it looks so beautiful. Okay, so, this will breed those and see what happens. Alright, and yeah, I don't really need any more hybrid reds at the moment. Like, I am set. I do know I can get hybrid uh, red roses. 
or I can get blue roses from my hybrid red, so that's good. Okay, so what did I get? Let's see. Uh, Dear Warder, I'm sending you this letter from India. Thanks to you, I've been eating delicious curries all day, every day. I heard someone play an instrument I thought you'd enjoy. Ooh. What have you sent me? I wish you would have sent me some curry. A sitar. Thanks. All right, from HHA. Oh, wonderful. Seated 70,000 points. Seems you have the sense of a pro interior decorator. That's good. Uh, I don't really need to keep that. I'll probably keep the 100,000 letter. Or 150,000. Gold HHA plaque. Nice. Alright, so... What's going on, Soleil? How are you doing? Alright, I want to chat. Uh, you should get a good night's sleep tonight if you want to compete in the bug off tomorrow. Will I be competing? Well, here's the thing. Mornings aren't really my cup of tea, but who knows? Stranger things have happened. It's not even in the morning, <laughs> so you don't have to worry. Alright, and then I got this letter from the HHA, which is 90,000 points. Nice. I'd like to get up to 150,000. Alright, let's grab this. Okay, for 90,000 points, I get a silver HHA trophy, which is a little different than the plaque. All right, so let's go ahead and set these somewhere. I got Goldie's pick yesterday. I'm so happy about that. Like, seriously, that was just amazing. She is such a sweetheart in town, I tell you. She is Isabelle's little assistant or something like that. I don't know. All right, let's set this silver HHA trophy right here. Uh, as for this thing, I don't really know where to put it. Actually, hold up. I don't know where to put it. Let's put this right over here. I can put things on the fireplace. And obviously you put trophies on the fireplace. That just goes without saying. Uh... Okay, there we go. Alright, next up... This thing. Ooh, that sounds cool. I like it. All right, let's put this over here. And do I have anything else interesting? This tent wall. That actually looks kind of cool, I have to say. Microwave. I guess I'm going to put this microwave here. I guess I feel like getting a snack. <laughs> All right, anyway... Uh, let's see. I don't really need any of this other stuff. Mega Nebuloid. Oh, didn't I kick you out? Oh, no, I didn't. You're just new. Huh. Alright, well, have fun staring at that wall. Okay, so... Guess I should see what's up in town right now. Oh man, I hope that my 3DS capture holds out. <laughs> like, seriously. I'm worried it's on its last legs. I think it's just the USB. I think something happened. I tried to reinstall the drivers or something like that. I don't know. I don't know. I don't really care. I just want it to work. That's what I want. So, hopefully it will. Now, what I could really use right about now, I need some suggestions for public works projects from the villagers. Like, seriously, I don't want to do the whole diving thing. I don't know, it's not really, not really my cup of tea, but I really do want to get them suggesting stuff, so I don't know. All right, I heard that the right decor in your house can make napping three times as satisfying. Okay, I gotta recommend him some furniture. All right, let's take a good look. What would be good? Or his house. Um, maybe like a kitty thing. Let's see. Yeah, I'll see what's available in the shop. <laughs> Give Bones some more bones, Beautiful Days 4 says. I don't know, maybe. Would be kind of funny. Cesar, how you doing? 
Old timer. You talking to me? I'm impressed to see that you're surviving, Capiche. All right, I want to chat. Uh, hey, pal. Why don't I go to your house today and take a look at how you got your stuff all set up, Capiche? All right, sure, why not? Okay, so it's got to be after 4, right? Yeah, so let's do 4 p.m. Such a long time. I hate that you have to wait that long. Like, it should be 30 minutes. 30 minutes seems fair. Okay, let's get my 15th... Actually, I'm sorry, my 16th balloon clock. Still haven't gotten any other, like, tools. Oh, Kitty Bureau. Wow! I've not gotten that before, and that probably looked pretty good in Bones' house. All right, anyway, how are you doing, Agnes? Supporter, will you help me? I'm gathering signatures of the No More Makeup petition. Wow, all right. It's an important issue. You're heading to another town. Could you get some names for me? Gotta get it done by today's end. All right, that sounds great. I think I will do that. So, looks like I'll at least have something to do. I'll be visiting another town to get some signatures today, but that will definitely make Agnes rather happy. All right, so... Let's go ahead and bust this thing. Oh yeah, you know what? I have that miniature being refurbished. Maybe I should refurbish the Kitty Bureau for Bones. I bet he'd like that. I think I'm gonna do that. We'll give it to him later. First things first, though, I need some coffee. All right, yes. Give me some coffee, Brewster. Uh, just a bit of milk. Porter always likes his coffee the same way. All right, let's see. I could have sworn he told me a different number the other day. <laughs> uh, oh, well, maybe it's different... Like, based on the cup? I, I don't know. 175 degrees Fahrenheit seems pretty hot. That is Fahrenheit, by the way. <laughs> Just in case you're uh, thinking, oh my gosh, that's so hot in Celsius. Yeah, that would be unbelievably hot. Okay, let's go ahead and go on over here. Because I did get that fossil miniature the other day. Well, I got all the pieces I needed for it, so it should be a nice little tiny parasaur. Nice. Thanks, pal. Okay, so I gotta give bones. I refurbished Kitty Bureau. Wait, what's this? Oh, right, the exotic table. Well, let's do this Kitty Bureau. Get him something that looks fancier. All right, what do you suggest? Uh, how about fruit colored? Okay, so 348 it'll be done. My time, at least. All right, yeah, he doesn't have that. But that would look pretty nice in his house, I bet. Hmm. All right, so... Lots to do today. I guess before I head on over to another town, I wouldn't mind just uh, doing a little bit of talking around town to see... What everyone else is up to, see what Mira's up to, see what uh, Rory is up to. And Olaf! Good old Olaf. Alright, Mira, how are you doing? Uh, whoa, Werder, this is unexpected. Well, I got nothing to offer you, but if you want to hang out. Alright, uh, does she have another rugby tee? That's kind of weird. What the heck? <laughs> I thought she was wearing the one that I gave her. That's awkward. Ever get that where, like, you get the same gift on your birthday? Huh. You need some music in here. Alright, anyway. Adios. Hmm. 
All right. Rory in the house. Let's see what he's up to. Oh my gosh. He's got Olaf over. Are you serious? These two really are in cahoots. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> oh, this is bad. This is so bad. <laughs> Whoa, what are cool. You've come to see Rory too, huh, you loser? What's up? Hey, Warder, I saw Katrina, the fortune teller, set up here in town. Oh, I should probably talk to her. Oh my gosh, are you serious? Hey, hey, good timing. Olaf, stop by too, Capital. What can I help you with? All right, tomorrow's the bug off. I'm starting to get a little nervous, but I'm not going to let you beat me, Warder. It's on, Capital. Wow. I had a feeling that they would be in on it together, but shoot. This is literally the first day that he's unpacked everything. He's already got Olaf over. Man. What has happened to this town, I tell you? All right, I'm going to leave that fossil spot for a little bit. <sighs> really tired today. I don't know why. Oh, right. It's getting upgraded. Oh, that's right. I forgot about that. Oh, well, that's it's a good thing. Definitely a good thing, but... Man. Alright, let's see. Oh, look at this. It's a Mr. Rogers shirt. <laughs> Sweater vest. Wait, I already have this. Gosh darn it. Uh, you know what? Probably don't want to get anything here today. Whoa. Hold up. Changing my mind. I gotta get this sombrero. Alright, let's try this thing on. Oh yeah, there we go! Oh, that's brilliant. I'm keeping this on today. And a plain black cap. I don't remember if I have this or not. I'll buy it anyway, just in case. Same with this melon hat. Might as well. All right. Ay caramba! <laughs> we gotta go, uh... We gotta go to another town, right? Don't I have that petition? I believe I do. Let's see. Yes, I do. Oh, man. I need to sell some stuff off, too. Okay, so... Let's take a look. I guess I'll just go ahead and drop some stuff off. I guess it'd probably be fine to take a trip on over. Actually, I know what I need to do. I need to chop down some trees. Specifically one tree. That poor dead tree. Wait, what does this have to say? Oh yeah, tomorrow's the bug off. Alright, we get it. Okay, this thing needs to go. Get out of here. Sorry! Alright, next up. Haha. -ha. Okay, so... If I'm going to a town, I should probably bring some of Cheville's finest peaches. This is bad. I don't even have room. Gosh darn it. Okay, well, that's fine. I got an idea. Here's what I'll do. I'm gonna be a little cheap. I'm gonna only bring eight. <laughs> I'm sorry, but I need to bury this one. Gotta regrow it. All right, retail, here I come. All right, here we go. Some room in my inventory, geez. Uh, oh, no, I don't want to get rid of the Parasaur model or the yellow cap. 
Yeah, let's get rid of this stuff. I'm going to get rid of this axe, too. It's about to break. I have more. Okay, there we go. All set. Now, let me get some peaches. Then, I gotta visit a subscriber's town for a little bit of, uh, signature stuff. Probably be good to visit a town I haven't visited before. Guess I have enough time for a little bit of a tour. Since it's not like there's anything in the shop I can buy today. You know what? I just realized one of these trees is probably gonna break now that I sold my axe. Oh no, we're good! Everything's fine. Uh... Alright, there we go. Okay, yeah, we'll do that. Okay, so... Let's see. Guess we'll see who's around. All right, let's visit another town. Okay, who we got right now? Oh, looks like Neil Burrow's rather busy. I'm guessing, uh... Missing a little bit of turnips going on. All right, Bruce and Memories. Who is this? I have all my windows and stuff closed. And my spreadsheet. Darn it! Uh, let's see. I wonder if that's Bud2004 saying, My town's open if anyone needs a Katie drop-off or signatures. Hmm. That might work. Probably what it is. I don't think I've been to Bud's town. All right, let's see. Doo -doo. Spooky Venom saying open as well. I did visit your town a bit ago, though. Like, I'd rather spread it out if possible. That was a while ago. Uh, or did I visit your town? I'm trying to remember. I think I did. Yeah, I did. You had the gyroid dungeon. How could I forget that? <laughs> All right, let's see. Oh, there we go. Yeah, that's Bud's. I'll see if uh, Bud is available. All right, let's see. I've not been there, I'm pretty sure. Hmm. All right, cool, looks like I can go there. All right. Well, this will work out all right. Oh, man. I don't know why I'm so tired today. I got a full night's sleep. <laughs> it's weird. I didn't get much sleep yesterday, and it's probably just starting to catch up to me. I like the sombrero. <laughs> it's actually a good look for water. Kind of gets the job done. All right, let's see. Ooh, I like these paths. 
I don't have the wave emote, so I'll just do the I'm here emote! Oh, I like that beret. <laughs> I'm one to talk about a nice hat. Gifts. Do, do, do. All right, let's take a look. And hopefully it's nothing too rare. I want to get stuff on my own, but I do like some music. All right. Moment of truth. We've got oh, KK parade and a silver slingshot. Oh, that's great. Although I do want to get the tools on my own. I do apologize, but I, I do want to get stuff. On my own for tools. Music's not a problem though. All right, but I do appreciate the thought. Yeah, I should be able to get music a lot more reliably tomorrow uh, once the store is upgraded, so I do not mind getting more music. It's always appreciated. All right, I need to track down some villagers. Hey, it's Freya! Oh, it's you, Warder. You remember me, right? I'm Freya Fabu. Oh, she lives here in memories now. Huh. That's interesting. I'm like, wait, why do you remember me? Okay, no more makeup for Freya. She's so pink. <laughs> All right, cool. All right. Oh, I guess we have someone over here, don't we? Let's take a look. Oh, someone's not home. Actually, this is Freya's home. No, it's Rocco's house. No, oh, I don't see him around. It's too bad. This is a nice stretch. Oh, look at all these cherry trees here. There's Freya's house, of course. It's very pink. Oh, hey. It's Elise. <laughs> you must be the guy I keep hearing about from Shavilla, right? Warder, is it? All right, well, wait, run away. Run away! <laughs> all right, I need you to sign this. No more makeup. All right, no problems there. Okay, looks like someone's home over here. Actually, it looks like two villagers are home. I like this pattern, it's quite nice. Oh, it's Pango. Hey! <laughs> I seriously feel like I've known you forever. Maybe we met in another life. Yeah, it's called my Waffles Life, of course. All right, I need you to sign this, please. I love those botoids. They're just such a good sound. They kind of sound like pigs, though. But that's okay. All right, next up down here. Oh, it's a squirrel. Hazel. <laughs> did she say pump it up? <laughs> yep, she did. Pump it up! <laughs> Alright, no more makeup. <laughs> Lilac Chicky saying, you want funny sounds, check out the two toids. Oh, that was like one of the first gyroids I ever got in this, uh, this town. Well, in my town, rather. Oh, you know what? Speaking of this town, I should probably update the spreadsheet. Or not the spreadsheet, the layout. All right, let's do that really fast here. Oh, there's actually no dream address that I see on the spreadsheet, so I guess we'll just have to 
leave it at that. Uh-oh. <laughs> Do not go over here! Oh, nice wind turbine. Ooh, I gotta get a cup of joe. Always gotta sample the local coffee, you know? That's really important. Really important stuff. Hey. Okay. I could use a cup of joe. Ooh, the memories blend. Huzzah! Oh, that's delicious. I should update the town anyway. I'm gonna do that. Alright, there we go. It'll be updated in a second. Alright, so... Definitely some tasty coffee here. Alright. Oh, I kind of want to take a nap right there. Oh, so I guess there's not anyone over here. This is a nice big expanse. Hmm. I'm gonna need to track down some more villagers. How many are in town? Who have I not seen? Sydney. I haven't seen Sydney or Vesta or Marshall, actually. Odd. I wonder where the heck they are. Oh, it looks like someone just moved out. Maybe they're, like, wandering around or something. I guess I'm gonna have to kind of <laughs> look around here. Alright, I guess I'll check retail out. Offenheim's villagers hide in there. need one or two more signatures. Uh, no, no one in here. Well, shoot! That's unfortunate. Okay, to Main Street I go! Unless maybe they are just, like, wandering around. Oh, that's cool! Presents! <laughs> I like that! That's really neat! I like that! Man, that's really funny. It's a good idea, though. Have presents set up for your villagers? Or not for your villagers, but like for your visitors. see anyone over here. That's surprising. Alright, well, let's check out the museum then. I guess I'll say hi to Vesta. Who knows where everyone else is. we go there's TY oh. oh I don't think you're actually in town are you no nope. well take a quick look in the uh <laughs> in the shop rather curious myself this is what it'll look like tomorrow except with more stuff but yeah they'll start selling music which is nice definitely an improvement Okay, I think I missed a message, but it's fine. It's fine. Actually, what do I have for my initiatives today? Good fit initiative. All right. Pay it forward. Send someone in your town a letter with a little something extra. Pro design. I should do some of these things. Fairly easy. 
Okay, over by the fossils, apparently, we can find Vesta. I really hope that that's the last signature I need. Ooh. Nice, uh, collection. Oh, nice. This looks like it's complete. Shoot. Awesome. So jelly. I'm getting close to completion. Which is nice. There she is. She looks like a Marie. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's get your signature. No more makeup. No more. Oh no, I need someone else. Oh, what? This is a pain. Probably just one more. I hope one more. Otherwise, there's gonna be a problem. <laughs> like, uh... Guess I'll check the bugs. Why are they so darn elusive? At least they have some time before... Gotta get back. Hmm. This isn't good. I don't see anyone. Oh my gosh. This is like, I feel like I need a megaphone or something. is someone there's like Marshall and there was someone else there are like a few villagers Marshall and shoot I don't remember I don't have the list <laughs> yeah Tambalon saying unfortunately you can't use the megaphone in multiplayer yeah I know that's part of the reason why I wish I could but yeah even at that, I don't know if it'd work if they're hiding over here. Oh, no. <laughs> Darn it! You scared me! Alright, so they're not even over here. Rocco, that's right. Gotta find Rocco. Maybe they're in the art section. <laughs> Usually they're in Bruce's face all the time. Dang. There we go, there we go. Okay. Thank goodness. <laughs> that was quite the uh quite the hunt, I tell ya. Alright now. I need you to sign this thing. That's a really trippy shirt, by the way. Yay! Thank goodness! I filled up the, uh, the petition. Alright, so... Let's see if I can maybe take a quick look at the house if that's something, uh... That Bud would be interested in showing. Yeah, 
Yeah, I got a little bit of time to kill before Agnes. Or not Agnes, before... Cesar. I got, like, all this stuff I gotta do. At 3.48, I gotta get back for the painting. And it's not, like, time-sensitive. That's just when it's done. And then at... Let's see. When would it be? Four. I got Cesar. No. Yes. Cesar. And then... Whoops, I'm going the wrong way. Then at... some point, I have to give the thing to... Bones, Kitty Bureau, and then I have to give the signature thing to Agnes. Yeah, all this stuff I gotta do, man. <laughs> it's fine, though. Oh, the Master Sword! Am I worthy to pull it? Ah! Yeah! <laughs> I love it. Turn up Mafia money. <laughs> I love it. This is nice. Have a nice TV with the blue bench there. Oh no, Lilac Chicky saying you need 13 hearts. That's right. Whoa, this is cool. Ooh. Ah, that's right. Blue stripe. I remember collecting all this way back. It was a pain. It was a definite pain, but it was worth it. Whoa. All right, let's see what we got in here. Oh, hey, we got the essentials. <laughs> All right, make yourself at home. Gonna take a quick shower if you don't mind. I like it. Turn on some lights, though. It's so dark in here. All right, so I think that leaves this room over here. <laughs> Lilac Chicky saying, well, when you gotta go, you gotta go. Yeah, you can at least shut the door. Oh, balloons. Yes. Rousing game of table tennis. Oh, yeah. Oh, we're so good at this despite not actually doing it right. <laughs> oh, my gosh, that's a lot of balloon chairs. <laughs> oh man, I hope he went upstairs. Oh, no, maybe not. Oh well, this looks nice though. Mm-hmm, so this is what's in there. I see. I like it. And lastly, the basement. Classy. Classy. I'm surprised you have windows in the basement. <laughs> oh man. That's funny though. I like it.
<laughs> Let's type properly now, please. All right, there we go. Okay, I gotta catch a train back to... Javille. No makeup. Oh, there's Sydney. She's so purple. Uh, yeah, your tone's it's pretty great. I like it. What was that? I'll take some presents. <laughs> Let's see if I have room. Uh, I have room for five, exactly. That's actually a pretty funny idea. I like it. It's like, you don't know what you're gonna get. <laughs> it's like, oh man, this could be anything. All right. Okay, well, very cool. Definitely a very welcoming, uh, accommodating town. Good old memories. Uh, I don't see a dream address listed, but again, it seems like, uh, seems like Bud2004 is always open for some guests to visit. And has some presents, which is kind of nice. So, uh, if you are a Twitch subscriber, or if, uh, you can track them down, be sure to do so. It was a nice town. Nice visit. I liked it. Oops, uh, what am I clicking on? Something isn't working right. What? What have I done? I'm just trying to say something on Discord, gosh. Alright, anyway. Wait, what? What? Espeon dude saying, Amiibo cards can be used en masse in Breath of the Wild to get stuff. <gasps> what? Oh, no way. I didn't use Amiibos for the my first playthrough on the Wii U. But it's like, you know what? I have to play through this again anyway. I'm going to use the heck out of Amiibos. So that is brilliant. I'm just going to sit there and just toss cards at it. That'll be great. All right, so I have some new music, which is rather nice. And again, I will be getting access to music really soon. Like, I can buy music every day. So it's not going to be quite as rare as it used to be. Which is why I'm totally down for accepting that. Now, I will... I'll have to discard anything that uh, is, like, super rare or anything. Like, my whole policy when it comes to gifts... I don't want to get anything like, uh, you know, blue roses or any event items or things like that. If it's like minor stuff or fruit, like, I totally don't mind that. Um, but, I think we'll be fine. Like with the slingshot, I, I want to get my own, uh, slingshot. Okay, I got my KK Groove. Gotta get back to that. Okay, I need... Oh, I need to set this Parasaur model up over here. I got a whole bunch of these little fossils. <laughs> That's kind of neat. Hmm, I should probably reorder them. Hmm. 
Wait. Gosh darn it, do I have two Parasaur models? Oh my gosh, I think I do. These are identical, are they not? Uh, they appear to be identical. Oh well! Guess I got a spare. Alright, let's, uh, let's open up these presents later. I'm going to get signatures to Agnes. Gotta get the Kitty Bureau. Give that to Bones. Then I gotta be back in my house at four. Oh, Beautiful Days 4 saying give one to Bones. That's a really good idea. That's a really good idea. Because that's like kind of customized and kind of cool. Hey, he'd like that. That's a really good idea. Okay, I got your signatures, Agnes. I hope you are happy with this. Wow, amazing. People really got behind the whole... For the old no more makeup issue. Yeah, no more makeup. <laughs> All right, well, that wasn't too bad. Uh, you're okay with a nice kitty stereo, right? Uh, okay, I do need something to play my music with. That much I'll tell you. Kitty stereo, on the other hand. Although it does look really cool refurbished, I do remember. Okay, I like this idea of giving Bones the Parasaur model. Since I have two of them... Let's see. <laughs> Leo's are saying, wearing makeup right now, L-M-A-O. <laughs> I know, well, not in Cheville anymore. No, nope. no more makeup here. Okay, so are these both Parasaur models? They look like it. Let's see. Parasaur model. Paras oh my gosh. I made a second Parasaur model. Oh, and you know what I need to do? I need to update my sidebar thing. Huh. Okay, now the question is, do I want to wait around for Cesar or do I want to get this Bones thing taken care of? Let's take care of Bones right now. Oh my gosh. Two Parasaur models! That's ridiculous. Of course, I wasn't really tracking what I already had as far as models go. That probably would have been smart. It's just like, oh my gosh, I got all of them! Gotta make something with that! Alright, old buddy, old pal, good old Bones. I got something that'll look perfect in here. Okay, you're gonna love this. Parasaur model. That is perfect for you. Nice! I had my eye on a Parasaur model just like this one. It was probably my other one. Now where should I put it? Great, I'm gonna put it right here. Oh, please put it somewhere good. Where is it? Uh... Oh wow, it looks super sweet! Well, I don't need my rainbow stag anymore. ARE YOU SERIOUS?! ARE YOU SERIOUS?! I toiled for like 20 minutes trying to get you a rainbow stag yesterday. I get you the rainbow stag and then you're like, well, I don't need it anymore. I guess you can have it back. Bones! Bad dog. Like, like, really? Bones! Man! Alright, that's just ridiculous. <sighs> well, I'm gonna save that for the next person who will be a lot more grateful for it. All right, I'm home. I swear if Cesar's like right outside, that'd be kind of creepy. 
Nightwolf1998 saying, and taking bones is quickly losing your favor, Maryland. Oh, he's quickly losing that. That happened a few days ago. Goldie is now best dog in town. Cesar! Okay, there he is. <laughs> well, it's me, Cesar. Here to hang out, capiche? Oh my gosh. I'm gonna bury bones. Why? Thanks, I'm just gonna come on in for a bit, capiche? Yeah, capiche. Alright. You want some ramen or some pizza? Ha. Or, I mean, I just thought your room would be a bit different than this is all. You know, I'm kind of relieved now that I see it, capiche? When I buy furniture on a whim, I'm so excited that I bolt straight home no matter where I am. Regardless of how old I get, there's just something fun about brand new pieces of furniture, capiche? Uh -huh. I can tell you probably spend a lot of time in this room. Yeah, I do. Alright, let's take you to the lair. The lair that everyone must behold. It's beautiful. I'm guessing you designed this room with some sort of concept or theme in mind. I bet I wouldn't understand it even if you told me. <laughs> oh no, it's pretty simple. It's this guy is our king. And we all worship him, and he is being summoned from the depths below. That's how it goes. <laughs> uh, and the, the throne, of course. It's kind of one of those wacky rooms. But that's fine. It's good to have wacky rooms. Am I right? Am I right? I'm right. All right, now this is my work in progress room. I think it looks very you. So how are the other rooms? Well, fine. Then. Jeez, you don't even care about this room. Unimpressed, man. All right, let's take you over to the balloon room. My least favorite room in the house. I just want to get this set complete and then be done with it. I see, so this is where you keep your mansion, huh? It seems pretty cozy, right, capiche? Uh, yeah, this is a theme representing all the hatred I have in my heart <laughs> towards balloons. All right, upstairs, buddy, come on. I like this room. I also like what I did with the gyroids now. I suppose that's one way of arranging furniture. I think I sort of understand what you're going for. Either sitting or lying down on a nice big couch like that. Man, it's hard to beat. A modern wood sofa looks like it'd be really comfy to sprawl out on and just take a nap. Does it really? It doesn't really look that comfy, to be honest. Oh, wow, you have time for TV? I always see you outside, so when do you get the time to watch? Oh, you know, in the other 22 hours a day that I'm inside of the house. Basement time, buddy. Uh, Beautiful Days 4 asking, what song plays upstairs? I think it's KK Flamingo. Wow, is that one of those weird gyroids? Specifically a weird nebuloid one. This is really giving me some insight into your complex mind. I mean, it makes sense you'd be into something like that. It's not a bad thing at all, capiche? This room feels unusually tidy. Maybe that's because... Or maybe that's just because it's almost empty, yeah? Yeah. Hey, uh, don't Gandalf me, pal. Come on. All right. Are you done here? If there's anything you don't want me to touch, just let me know in advance. Uh, I mean, you probably expect me to come here and touch all your stuff anyway, but just to be safe. Yeah, you know what? <laughs> don't touch my pizza, all right? We won't have any problems if you don't touch that. I think I'm gonna leave that slice for myself. All right, you ready? You done? Hey, stop looking at that picture of Goldie, all right? Only I can look at that picture of Goldie. Well, and I guess technically everyone that walks in, but that's besides the point. Well, I think it's about time for me to hit the old dusty trail. We didn't really talk about anything important, but it was fun hanging just the same. Yeah, it was. It was pretty good. All right, so I got all these presents while I'm over here. Let's see what I wound up with. I got a pop-up book. A pastel dot wall. 
A bow! Got a maple umbrella. And... Ooh, an exotic lamp. Those are kind of neat. And I think I'm probably going to end up taking them to retail. But again, they are added to my catalog, which is always, always a nice thing. Because I am trying to fill that out. All right. Oh, yeah, look at that. That actually really lightens up the room. Say that as I look at this darn thing, which doesn't. Hmm. Um. Pop-up book, though. What is this all about? Hey! That's kind of cool. But I don't think I can set it anywhere. Okay, I want to refurbish this kitty stereo. I think that'd look nice. And what was this other thing I had? Oh, yeah, pop-up book, bow. Yeah, I think I'm going to set that stuff away. I'm going to be looking for that yellow hat. I just know it. All right, let's put this rainbow stag away. I'm not going to turn that in later. Because the amount of times I get asked, yo, you got a rainbow stag, is too darn high. So I think by having a rainbow stag in advance, I can just be like, yo, I got you covered. Don't worry. We're all good. All right, let's take this stuff away. Random 18 saying, in before Bones asks for one. Man, it's all cloudy. It was like super bright and sunny just a little bit ago. All right. Wait, 14 hours of sleep, did you say? Or I don't even remember. Uh, let's see. When the weather's nice, nice like this, there's nothing like a tall glass of black tea. I guess so. Uh, hello, Werner. You seem chipper as always. Oh, not quite. Sometimes when I'm alone in my house, I get kind of creeped out. If you're free right now, it would be great if you could come over and keep me company. Ah, sure. Alright, I mean, with scoundrels like Olaf and Rory in town, I don't blame you. Alright, Goldie's house. <laughs> she even locks the door. Oh my gosh, why did you put that there? <laughs> I'm sorry, Goldie, but this is like one of the dumbest things imaginable, okay? Couch! Couch! Like, if there were a big screen TV, maybe that'd be good, but... You got two couches! I'm gonna have to take one of those couches from you. That's what I'm gonna have to do. Um, let's see... coming over, playing your harpsichord. Yay! <laughs> she liked it. Wait, how do you burn things? You don't even have a kitchen in here. You don't even have any way you can start a fire in here. How do you burn things? I'm a little confused. Alright, so will you... Oh, I'll definitely try sitting on my minimalist sofa if you haven't already. Well, maybe I should get rid of the other one. Hmm. Simple love seat. Oh, that's this thing, right? I'm not really inspecting everything in your room, except for the fact that I am. But, oh well, that's fine. Okay, I'll sit on your simple love seat, alright? There. This is kind of odd. You're like, <laughs> breathing down my neck, quite literally. Uh, Espeon dude saying, wouldn't it be cool if the instruments played notes to the tune of the song? They actually do play in the beat of it. Like, if you press it at the right time, you can actually make music that kind of works with the, or make, uh, like, notes that kind of work with it. It's not perfect, but it is kind of neat. Alright, yeah, your furniture's nice. Okay. We gotta get rid of this thing. 
No, we don't. Okay, we gotta get rid of this thing, then. That I just gave you. What is with you dogs? You just, like, get rid of the stuff you just got all the time. Oh, well. Mistakes were made. I need a bed back here. See, I cheaped out. My only options were a hammock or a minimalist sofa, and I thought she liked that so much better. I was wrong! Alright, anyway, see ya, Goldie. Yeah, your place is the best now. Mainly because you're the best. Alright, there we go. Taken care of. So... What else does that leave me to do today? I don't really think all that much. To be honest. Just selling off this stuff and... That'll probably do it. Because I think I've talked to everyone. Except for Tutu. Let's talk to Tutu. See what she's up to. Alright, what's going on, Tutu? You know one of the things I love about, or most about good old Cheville are pear trees. You want a pear? No problem. I will get you a pear. Well, actually, just one. Let's do that. Actually, hold up. Hold up. Priorities. Priorities! I gotta get this darn kitty stereo refurbished. That's what I gotta do. Because I have the... Hero. Hmm. Okay, will you take this stuff from me, please? Yeah, not to be ungrateful, but I am actually very grateful that it, uh, is in my, whatchamacallit, my catalog. Oh my gosh, that is very vibrant. <laughs> Dang. That's pretty bright. I don't know, this could be a challenge. Maybe I'm getting a little in over my head here. I kind of want to do something with that, though. Alright, let's get this thing going. What do you suggest? Fruit or pastel? Like, I think I saw pastel colored and it was alright. But I'm excited about this fruit color design. Gotta do something with this. Alright, now I'm not going to do that today, but I am rather curious to see what it'll look like tomorrow. Set that up in another room somewhere. I don't know where, probably the balloon room. <laughs> It would fit in very well over there. Actually, have I seen Sylvia yet today? I don't think I have. I don't even know where she's at. Like, I haven't seen her. Not home. Oh, Katrina! That's right. Derp. There's the other thing I needed to do. They did say she was in town, like, an eternity ago. Alright. Oh no, great misfortune. No, I don't want misfortune. You have to save me. Yee. I love that part. Always my favorite part. The sloth who works hard shall sadly never be called a hard worker. Oh no, disaster upon your health. Long sleeve shirt. This is bad. I need a long sleeve shirt, pronto. Okay. Man, I got lucky. I didn't, like, fall into a ravine or something today. Well, I'm almost done, so I don't really feel like changing into a long sleeve shirt at the moment. Guess the power of this sombrero will kind of protect me from anything. Uh, so the other day, I went to a swap meet for summer stuff. Yeah, you really find out about your true nature in a place like that. The shoppers were like predators hunting down the best deals. Oh, sounds like Black Friday. Oh, man. All right, let's see. Got to get a perfect pair for Tutu. 
We gotta get rid of Sylvia, Mira, or uh, Agnes. I hate to say it, but the reality is they're all the same personality type. That'll do. All right. Um, just so I don't forget about it, let me set this thing up right here. Oh my gosh, that is so bright! Man! Alright, let's see. What do I need to do? Oh, I need to give this to 2-2. Two, two. Then I'm done! Shiny Misty saying, get rid of Sylvia, or is she not an option? Uh, she's on the table. Eventually, one of them will be kicked out for Cheville Idol Season 2. Okay, now where did that bear go? Where are you? I just saw her, too. Gosh darn it, this happens all the time. Okay, let's do this. Nope! Ambulon's saying you need a peppy baby, Maryland. That's why I have Tutu. She's a peppy villager, I think. Pretty sure. Yeah, she's definitely peppy. I feel like with Sylvia, I've given her so much, and she doesn't ever really, like, give back. Like, she gives okay gifts, but nothing that much. Uh, yeah, Tambalon, I'm pretty sure she is peppy. Like, she's very energetic and stuff all the time. I think Goldie is the only normal personality type. <laughs> that sounds kind of funny. Um, oh, hey. So this is what you want to see if you want to get beans, by the way. I wonder if I can get more beans. Yeah, you have to say, hey, Harv, when he is, uh, tossing beans. And sometimes you have to do this a few times. Give me more beans. No, no, no. Give me, give me the beans. Want some beans? Hey, Harv. <laughs> hey, Harv. Well, it's not a huge deal. Eh, whatever. Uh, but yeah, when you see him tossing beans like this, that's when you can get some beans. Maybe there has to be like a certain number of birds down. I'll try like one more try after this. All right, one more. Whoa! Brandishing that shovel. Or go over to the beans, Harv. Ah, whatever. That's fine. That's fine. Whoops. Ambulon saying, to be honest, I wish normal villagers were called what they are in Japanese. They're called sweet in Japanese. Aw. Yeah, I really feel like the personality names are a little silly in English. Like, lazy. Like, all of the, the male personalities, or boys or whatnot, like, there's lazy, there's jock, there's smug, and there's cranky. Like... Come on, why can't you just have, like, a more neutral one? Like, I guess Lazy's supposed to be the neutral-esque personality, but... <laughs> it's like, uh, you know... Yeah. And then, I don't know, like, I feel like normal as a, per as a personality type is like... Oh, what's your personality type? Oh, you know, normal. <laughs> uh, alright, well then, <laughs> nice to meet ya. Yep, Goldie, you're just normal, all right? <laughs> and then the personality types for girls in this are normal, 
Peppy, Snooty, and Uchi, which is sort of like a big sister, tough girl kind of type. And I have three of these Uchi um, villagers. I have Sylvia, I have Agnes, and I have Mira. Oh, you. Where's Tutu at? Oh my gosh. Hey, Warder, I'm hoping you can help me with my craziest, or with my latest crazy fascination, dragonflies. I've got to have one, you loser. Would you track one down for me, Warder? Sure, why not? I'll get you a dragonfly. Not really what I wanted. But that's how it goes. Hmm. Gosh darn it, they crushed all my flowers. And trees and things like that. They're just terrible. Rory! He's... I don't like him. Alright, so there's a dragonfly right there. Look at that thing. Alright. At least there's no issue getting that. I did it! I caught a banded dragonfly! Now to find the rest of its band. Oh, well I don't have this one, darn it. I need a dragonfly I already have. Hmm. All right. Oh, there you are. Tutu, wait, come back. All right, I have a perfect pair for you. All right, all yours. <laughs> That's even more delicious than I thought it'd be, Warder. What a perfect pair. All right, have a hospital TV. What? A hospital TV. Go away. Oh my gosh. I need to get another dragonfly now. Because otherwise what's going to happen is I'm going to forget that I had this one. And I want to donate it to the museum. So that means I have to find a different dragonfly. Of course it would be too easy now, wouldn't it? Go away. Need a bug. Need a dragonfly. Maybe I should be wearing that long sleeve shirt and thinking about it. Uh, you know what? I'll be fine. Yeah, actually, I haven't run into any problems. Usually if you have bad luck... Oh man, I freaked out. I saw blue roses down there. <laughs> and then I... I put them there. Not bad. Okay, I'm gonna get a megaphone. Shout into it, Dragonfly, where are you? Might be on the beach, maybe. Oh, I can't wait until I get more blue roses. Once you get two blue roses, they're like, very easy to get. Oh, you know what? Let's say I'm 39. Bringing a very good point to my attention. Did you save one in your closet? I actually think I did. I'm gonna think of it. I think I'm just gonna go get that. All right. It's in one of these. Gotta be right here. Yep, there we go. Darn our dragonfly. I did! Well, splendid. Now watch, I'm gonna find a dragonfly as soon as they come out here, right? Knowing my luck. Holy, why can't you help me get a dragonfly? Do I have that thing? I think I do. I think it's just a normal, like, grasshopper. I'll get it just in case, like, it's common, but again, if I didn't have it before, because I thought, oh, I don't need that, I've already got that, and I didn't, that'd be a problem. Okay, I do not locate, or I have not located any other dragonflies, so we're going to give him this darner dragonfly. Dragonfly. 
All right, Olaf. Wait. Are you serious? Olaf is a jerk. Remember that sea bass he just had to have the other day? He got rid of my hospital bed that I sent him for a sea bass. I'm disgusted with you. <laughs> You're a jerk, Olaf. All right, here you go. Yeah, it's darn perfect. A shirt. A pep squad tee. Are you serious? Why would you do that? This guy needs to go. <laughs> He's the worst. Oh, man. I tell you, Rory is probably going to get on my nerves as well. That's just brilliant. Those two scheming together. No, they're up to trouble. All right, so I think that finally takes care of everything. So, I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you on the next episode. Which, by the way, Saturday, we're doing two streams instead of one. So I will actually be seeing you at both 3 p.m. Central Time for a little bit. Just a little bit, just to hand in some bugs. And then I'll be seeing you for 8 p.m. Central Time tomorrow for another um, another stream where we have the ceremonies of me winning and everything, <laughs> right? Anyway, I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you on the next episode of Maryland's Animal Crossing New Leaf Adventures in Cheville. See you next time, everyone. Woo! Thank you.